Hi, Shadia here, and it's breakfast time. Here's what we're making. We've got yellow potatoes. We've got vegan field roasted sausage, red onions, and red bell peppers, and chickpea tofu with garlic. Here I am rolling the skin off of the garlic. Quick and easy. That's number two. Now we're gonna take the little presser and mince the garlic. I got this gadget from um, Amazon. I think it may have been like $5. It may have been less, I'm not sure. I bought it a while ago, but I love that tool. Now we're gonna take the casing off of our sausages. And here we go. And now <clears throat> to make this quicker, I'm gonna line them all up together and slice them all at the same time. Be careful, watch your fingers. Now we go to heat our skillet with about two teaspoons of oil of your choice. I'm using grapeseed oil. And we're gonna smear that around the skillet, make sure the whole skillet is wet and scrape the garlic, peppers and onions into the skillet all together. Spread them around, let them toast. Now the potatoes, you can do them any way you want. I like them diced really small. Here I took some peppercorn, just um, enough to fit between my fingers, about, a, I wanna say about a quarter teaspoon and sprinkled them in the pan. And here goes my yellow potatoes, all diced small. You can do them big, you can do them flat and round, however you want them. I just felt like really small dice today. And we're gonna let that marinate together over a low flame with the lid on. Now we're coming back and I'm gonna do a half a teaspoon of dry mustard. You can use wet mustard, it doesn't matter, or no mustard. A half a two teaspoon of onion powder. And a half a teaspoon of garlic powder. Remember, you can't go wrong with those half teaspoons. Half a teaspoon of garlic powder. I'm sorry, ginger. I said garlic, ginger. And turmeric for coloring and for these aching knees of mine. <laughs> Half a teaspoon. And mix that all together. Make sure all the seasoning is all over the potatoes. Yes. Doesn't that look delicious? Mm. <laughs> I really should have made a gravy to go in that, but maybe next time. Here's our sausage, and we're just gonna incorporate that into the skillet. Now you don't wanna do too much in seasonings because those sausage have their own flavor, so 
That's why I like to start off with a half a teaspoon of each seasoning that I choose. And then once you do your taste test, you can add as you go. A little slow motion here. Mmm, doesn't that look delicious? Ugh. Heart be still. Okay, enough of that watching the potatoes dance with the sausage. <laughs> We're moving on. Okay, so I decided at the last minute to shred a carrot. I wanted to add some more color. So again, another gadget I ordered from Amazon. Amazon has not failed me yet. how nice and fine it shreds. I have to start using this gadget more often. Okay, into the skillet we go. Mix that all in together so that carrot can get some of that seasoning that's already in the skillet. And remember they said when you cook in iron, you put iron into your food. So I'm gonna try to do more cooking in my cast iron. I'm adding about a quarter of a teaspoon or half a teaspoon of celery, dried celery. I really didn't feel like cutting anymore. So I use the powder, the ground celery. Our pink Himalayan salt, I did do a taste test. Um, it needed just a little bit, so I used about a half a teaspoon of pink Himalayan salt. And again, you want to mix all of that together so that none of the seasonings is on one side of the food. Now let's go to the eggs. In our skillet, we're gonna put about a tablespoon of grapeseed oil, or again, oil of your choice. And make sure that entire skillet has oil. Now we're gonna take our chickpea tofu and crumble it into the skillet creating a egg-like texture a scrambled egg and we're gonna let that simmer a little So I added a little water to the sausage mixture because the oil had kind of dried out and we didn't want burn. So mix that up while the eggs are simmering. Well, the mocked egg, tofu mocked egg. And I forgot to add my cayenne pepper. So I put about a quarter to a half a teaspoon of cayenne into the sausage. 
and potato mixture. Back to the eggs, we're gonna mix this over. And I love eggs and cheese. So I took as about a quarter of a cup left in my bag of pom um, mozzarella. I'm sorry, I was gonna say Parmesan mozzarella cheese, and we're gonna mix that together. Let the cheese melt. And we're going to take our black salt and add, I think in total I added two teaspoons because what's funny about the black salt for me was that if you put it in while it's cooking, it seems to, the flavor just dies. So I added another teaspoon once it was ready and it came out perfect. Here is breakfast. We are all done. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and do share. Peace and love. I'll see you in the next video.